Hello guys, in this video, I am going to show you how to create a shortcut to launch your favorite file or application. Whenever I start my work every day, one of the applications I have to run is Ubuntu Virtual Machine, which I set up using VMware. The usual way I have to do to open this before is I have to go and open VMware and launch the virtual machine from there. Or I go directly to the file and run it. I find it really redundant and a little boring to do this all the time, so I found a way to launch my favorite apps or files by just hitting a key combination from a keyboard. To start, let's open Automator. You can easily launch this through Spotlight or Alfred by pressing Command Spacebar. Automator allows you to build workflows and run multiple actions on your Mac. Launching Automator will give these options. Let's build our workflow by creating a new quick action. In the older versions of Macs, this is called Services. Once we create a quick action, it is accessible anytime using Finder or the Services menu or even the Touch Bar menus for some MacBooks. I'll show you later once we have created this. So this means that we can launch this action anytime and it will process the workflow saved in it. Under workflow receives current, we don't need anything here, so let's choose no input. We can even specify an icon here, but it won't have any impact on our workflow. We have to set up two action items to complete the workflow. First, we need to find a location of the file, and second, run it. You can go here to the Categories section, but sometimes it's hard to find because you have a full list of action items here. You can use the search bar and find these actions. We have two similar action items in getting our file, Get Selected and Get Specified. We want a specific file to open, so we'll choose Get Specified for items. Let's remove this one, the Get Selected. Now let's click on add. Now let me open the location of the file first. This is usually a trick I use to not spend a lot of time finding the item. You'll just need to drag and drop the item to the open dialog folder and there you go. We have the file added here. By the way, you can open multiple files at once by using this method. But since I will only launch this uh, Ubuntu virtual machine, I'll leave it like that. The second action item after selecting the file is to actually open it. So we'll find Open Finder Items. You can leave it as default application since this file is already associated with VMware and we'll just open directly without launching the actual program. Okay, now before we save this shortcut, let's first test run and see if it works. So there you go, it works. Let's go and save this. Let's name it Launch uh, Ubuntu. Time to create our shortcut. Let's open the keyboard settings. You can also launch this from your system preferences, then find keyboard. Then let's go to the shortcuts tab. In the left pane, let's click services. Scroll down under general, then we have a quick action we've created here. Let's double click on it. Now you can enter a key combination here. In my case, I will use Alt-Command-3. If you go here in the menu Services, the quick action we've created is also here. This is available in any applications you've opened. That's it. Let's go ahead and test this now. I'll press Alt-Command-3 on my keyboard. There you go. It's now loading my Ubuntu virtual machine. Perfect, this is what I need. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you have any other tips using Automator, feel free to share them in the comment section. See you in the next one.